Okay, guys, I got a drive shaft off of a 1981 New Holland skid loader. Yoke went bad. I got the yoke here. New one, but this is all beat to heck. We cleaned it up. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take the die grinder here, or the fur bit. Got one that looks pretty darn close, if you can see that. We'll clean it up. We'll see if we can get it to work. Also got this dust ring, brand new. That should give us a good dimension. And it will not fit on there. It's tight. I don't know if this is egged out or not. <laughs> Okay, so what I'm going to do here is I got it really close. It'll come on. I'm going to put a little bit of uh, grease on the inside of this. And that'll give me an idea where all my high and low spots are. So I can knock them down. Because this shaft went flying around. So it could be egg shaped. It could be everything. So we're just going to try that. Kind of get an idea. So you probably can't see here, but there's a few spots. It's probably a good idea to use dirty grease, but you can see right here, there's some high spots. High spot, we need to take those down quick. Okay, here's what the main voyage here. Clean that guy up. Get all the burrs off. Not too bad cleaning it up. Oh. Oh yeah. There we go. All the way on. Like it's it's pretty it's tight too. Got no play there. So that's impressive. Alright. That's one way to clean splines up, or you could use an end mill. It would work also. Machine, whatever. That's how I did it. Greasy hand way. Thanks for watching. Maybe do an install here later. <laughs>